So I set this person's front yard on fire about three weeks ago. This is the place that I drove by and there's a ton of really good prairie species out here. So I knocked on their door. They gave me permission to manage it and burn it. And uh, check this out. You can't even tell I ran a fire through here besides all of these dead loblollies. But look at all this grass. I could literally run a fire through here again. I say this all the time. Prescribed fires and the fires out west caused from fire suppression are not the same thing. Look at all the fuel left here. You see in those mega fires, there's so much fuel on the ground. It's happening at a really dry time of year. It's burning so much that it's burning through the mineral soil. It's killing the seed bank. And you wouldn't have things coming back in three weeks like this. This is why fire needs to be a regular occurrence on the landscape. It's good for these ecosystems. This is the state listed mowers rosin weed. And there's literally thousands of them coming up out here now. But anyways, this is a service that the Native Habitat Project provides to landowners who have really high quality prairie sites. We do all this at no cost to the landowner. So if you'd like to help support us on projects like this one, go check out our Patreon or go check out our new t-shirts on our website.